In this video, we're going to go over a common problem with the digital torch height not operating correctly. Now, your digital torch height is a box located on your power unit, the PWM2 module. The wires that come out of the top, you need to verify the condition of those wires. If, by chance, when rolling cords up, maybe somebody bumped it, those wires then became damaged or pulled out or maybe they've been bent back and forth so often that they essentially um, break. You need to verify those wires. Make sure that that is firmly seated as well. That will take care of a lot of your issues. Now from there, <coughs> the yellow cord that runs from that PWM2 module runs all the way into your controller. Your controller is a cream colored box. It's the MP3700 box located center upper of your machine. That, that itself does three things. It gives you the start signal, the digital torch height raw arc voltage, and also the arc OK signal. Now, if you have any damage on that wire or vice versa, you need to replace it. Now, that being said, that's a very simple wire to just run externally of the machine and plug it in from A to B on the controller to the PWM2 module. It will then take the place of the other wire. Now, if your digital torch height is also not operating properly, what could have happened is you could have closed out of this screen as such. You thought it was closed and you went file, shut down, log out, and shut it down. Now, what happens is the four port hub, which is located in the upper left hand quadrant from your controller, then becomes disconnected as it's searching for communication, but it can't find it. So, the proper way to shut this down is to close out of this, hit this, the large switch on the side of your cabinet, the stop switch, shut the controller down, then go to menu, log out, shut down. That will alleviate a lot of your issues. Now, if it's not operating, what a guy needs to do is essentially open the CNC hub utility. Make sure that you are then closed out of this, open the hub utility, and it will say hub not connected if that's still open. Okay, so my hub is not connected. I will then hit the reset button on the four port hub. When I hit the reset button, it then turns on digital torch height 5, CNC hub connected, firmware version 1.8. I'm good to go. From here, I will close out of this, open command C and C again. I can then manually turn the torch on and off and look for any sort of reading. And that's just a real simple way. Uh, raise it all the way up off your material, remove e-stop, turn your torch on, this button right here, torch volts illuminate here, 180, 200, whatever. That means I know now that I have it connected and I'm ready to run.